Well, the Senate has begun investigating the $9.3 million seized by South African authorities from two Nigerians and one Israeli in a private jet that landed in South Africa. The Senate Committee on Defense and Army, which is investigating the incident, held a closed-door meeting with security chiefs at the National Assembly. The chairman of the committee, Senator Thompson Sekibor, confirmed that the $9.3 million seized by the South African authorities belongs to the federal government. We are starting the investigation. When we get through the investigation, we will brief you. Can that you matter. confirm that that money belongs to the Nigerian the, government? The money belongs to the Nigerian government, yes. The armed forces established by an act of the National Assembly. And then the act also spelled out categorically uh, their conduct and the way they are to behave wherever they are. Now, if you join the military, that act is to guide you, especially the laws that the don'ts of the act should guide you. If you go contrary to any of the prescribed uh, laws, the punishment prescribed for that act you violated will come on you. So uh, the military did not just wake up one day and say that uh, they are going to kill Mr. A or Mr. B. They went through their processes and they found them guilty.